let's face it, Daisy is great, but it isn't the smoothest of experiences. However, there are things you can do to increase its performance. And here, I'm going to tell you how you can improve your gaming experience tenfold. My suggestion and one of the biggest things you can do, and the reason I'm making this video, is you can download a program called LagoFast. This program is easy to use and comes with lots of options that not only fix numerous errors across all platforms, but it comes with features that specifically lower ping, as well as stabilizing network fluctuations. This is especially useful if you're trying to connect to a server in a different region, whether you're in the US and trying to connect to Europe, or in Australia and trying to connect to the US. It can definitely help with connection and gives you way less lag. Even ignoring the lag for a moment, you could see here just how much more smooth the gameplay can be. And this is with my normal setup, no difference except boosters on. That's it. You can even see here that although we draw at the same time, my booster connection helps me line up a lot quicker. This can make all the difference. It also comes with a frame rate booster, which in my experience on day Z gives around 10% more frames or so, or a push maybe 15, with it providing a lot more stability and consistency. Things like driving around does feel smoother, as well as entering high base areas. And although the game itself will always force drops, considering day Z behind the scenes is basically just a battlefield of code, you should still notice quite a difference. On PC, with an RX 1080, I was averaging just around around over 100 frames per second, but with the boost activated, that average went up to about 125. With my RTX 3080, it kept me at around the 200 mark both on extreme settings with VSync obviously off. And in addition to a plethora of other programs I have running in the background at all times. And although I'm focusing on DayZ because I'm a DayZ channel, it's kind of what I do, just know that it can boost and fix many other online games too. I use it for COD, GTA, Apex, and so on. Don't get me wrong, I still suck at those games, but now I suck in much higher frame rates. And with COD specifically, it actually removed all of the lag for me. It's free to try and I just think it's worth trying because it just has the potential to help so many people. This is a great way to keep your ping low and seeing if it works for you is absolutely free. I'll drop a link in the description and comments for anyone who wants to try or tell me your recommendations and for more content click here and as always until next time.